Hi guys, welcome to the second episode of Your Awesome, the Gerard Receiver Show. Today we have a special guest from Egypt who will be joining us here. He's a good actor and one of the busiest Arabic models here in UAE. But before that, let's watch this. All right, the coolest Egyptian I've ever met, Mr. Fadel Muhammad, also known as Il King Fadel. Hi Fadel, welcome to the show. Hello, my best friend Gerald. Uh, firstly, I appreciate your invitation to be with you in your art awesome. It's a good chance for me to be firstly with you mm -hmm. and uh, I'm so glad to be with your audience and your fans and your followers. And inshallah, it will be an amazing uh, interview. Inshallah. I hope you like it and all people like it, inshallah. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. I'm excited for that, Padel. Thank you for your time, Padel. I know you came from a shoot last night and you opted to be here to share your happiness. Okay? Yes, it was my pleasure to share happiness with you and uh, tell uh, all your audience and tell all people about my story, about my dream, about my passion. Uh, it was amazing to give to you the people positivity and confidence and power to go on and go far. That's awesome, Fadel, that's awesome. Yes. Our first meeting was during the shoot of Mercedes-Benz in Burj Khalifa, right? Yeah, I remember. Yeah, that was a year ago, last year, September. Yeah, properly. Okay, so can you tell us something about yourself because I don't know exactly who you are. I'm a simple person who have a, a big dream and a passion about acting and modeling. I saw all times myself in this career. I have passion about acting since when I was a kid. I I was I start to to dream and saw myself what what will be happen in the future. Okay. I am trying to make small roles in school theater and copy people like famous people like my teacher like my friend. What about actors? You copy the actors also? Anyone I can copy. Anyone. Oh. If I look to you five minutes, okay, I can copy you your body language, your voice, your uh, you're walking, you're acting, anything I can. Why you do that? It's a talent. It's my, it's my talent. That's why I'm passionate about acting. I can do all the rules, especially difficult to rule. Mm -hmm. uh, so, uh, in my life, I don't have impossible in my dictionary. I can do. I can do anything. Good. Excellent. Yeah. So, Fadel, how was your life in Egypt? You know, Egypt is a big country. We are uh, over uh, 110 million people. I'm enjoying in my country. I love my country too much. Whatever I'm uh, living outside Egypt, but I'm so proud that I'm Egyptian. And uh, I miss my country too much. That's why I remember, I still remember my life in Egypt when I was a kid and I'm growing up to be young and I'm starting uh, to work as a sales and customer service. Whatever, I should be accountant but I'm not working. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
because you know uh, it's my personality my character I'd like to deal with people I'd like to know new people okay. I'd like to help people uh, I find my happiness when I make other people happy that this is, is my my hobbies in life but uh, I'm not forget my passion about acting mm -hmm. during this journey I'm thinking about my dream and I'm still passionate uh, about acting and modeling and I'm still keep my dream go on to be a big and famous actor not in Middle East in Wall Street. <laughs> That's good, And you work in the sales? Yeah, it's a job. You have to, to work to earn the money to, to can stay in the life. Mm -hmm. Because you, you will not make a movie or a series or a TV commercial every day. So you have to provide yourself to earn some money to, to can live, to can buy food, to can buy cigarettes, to, to can enjoy. This is life. You prefer to work in sales than in a room like accountant? No, I'm not thinking never ever to work as an accountant. Since I am take my certificate from university, I'm not applying for any accounted job in my life. Okay. All my apply to sales and customer service. You worked before in Saudi Arabia, right? Yeah, uh, I told you I stay in Egypt up to 2008. And then I decide to, uh, to make a new challenge in my life to travel outside Egypt and explore new country like UAE. I got a good chance to come here to UAE as a sales in uh, Rag Bank, Bank Ras Al Khima. Uh, it was in uh, on uh, 2008, okay? It's the first time to travel outside Egypt. I came here to Dubai and see fantastic Dubai and our some people I find more than 200 uh, nationality. It mm. makes me also happy because, as I told you, I, I'd like to to know new people and explore new culture, new uh, tradition, new uh, mentality. How did Fadeli start his show discovery in UAE? We'll find out when we come back. So my question for you, Fadel, is how did you start your showbiz career here in UAE? I told you I'm passionate for uh, modeling and acting. So since I came here to UAE to work normal as a sales, mm -hmm. I find uh, a lot of fantastic and amazing chance in uh, media career. Then I apply for uh, all uh, agency for modeling and acting. I'm starting to going for uh, casting. And I'm not give up never ever. Uh, I'm not shortlisted for many castings until I got my chance and make my first TV commercial on uh, October 2013. It was a dream competition with a big brand, NBC channel. Uh, it, it's around 5 million people uh, chose this campaign on, in the Middle East. So it's amazing uh, experience and a good start when you start with a big brand you know if you are passionate about football and you dream to be a good player in football you dream to be a player in your uh, club in your country or your in your city but imagine someone take you and push you in real madrid or barcelona suddenly so it's amazing to be with a big brand like mbc and over 500 million people show you on TV, so it's amazing start with me. That's why I'm considering myself very, very lucky to make a good start and strong start like this. And uh, what are your biggest projects you have done so far? I make a lot of projects, but the biggest one is the two movies in Hollywood. The mm -hmm. first one, War Machine with the Brad Pitt. Mm -hmm. And second one, uh, Star Trek uh, 3, uh, with Chris Pine and a lot of famous actors in, uh, in Hollywood. And finally, on uh, last December 2019, I'm so proud to embody the character of uh, Hyson's uh, 
Sheikh Rashid bin Said Al Maktoum, mm -hmm. uh, the father of higher sons, uh, Sheikh Muhammad bin Rashid. Yeah, your poetry that uh, yeah, person, huh? Yeah, his, his character. Uh, you know, uh, I since Sheikh Muhammad bin Rashid make uh, my story as a book and we transfer to a uh, historic series. So I'm so proud to embody his uh, father character, mm -hmm. Sheikh, uh, I since Sheikh Rashid bin Said Al Maktoum. Uh, it's, uh, it's amazing to be a part of uh, UAE history and uh, you will be forever in UAE history. That's why I'm so proud and excited because I consider myself I'm very lucky to go to these three projects, two in Hollywood. And I want to tell you something, in Hollywood it's an amazing experience. Yeah, tell me. They are very organized, they are very professional in work. Uh, everything uh, organized by second. Mm -hmm. Nothing for luck, nothing for... Uh, uh, Just by one place like that? No, no, no. They organize everything. That's why uh, Hollywood is the best. Oh, right. So see. it's a good chance for anyone who dreams to be a good actor and you will learn and teach a lot of things from this industry. And they have a, a professional crew in all departments start from catering up to director. So it was uh, War Machine, Star war, Trek? War Machine, Star Trek, Star Trek 3, and my or, story. or you, can stay, you can say Star Trek Bayanda. Bayanda, okay. Yeah, and uh, my story for Hysen's uh, Muhammad Bel Rashid Al Maktoum, the ruler of Dubai. Was it the project that you paid for to, to, to land that role? Uh, my story. That means the story of Yeah, those. because this project already done before, on 2018, mm -hmm. but uh, rejected by uh, Hassan Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid. So the other production company uh, takes a chance and repeat it again. Surprisingly guys, Fadel has done two Hollywood movies, six Arabic drama series, and 15 commercials. Did you pay for that uh, role project or uh, yeah, sure. Uh, my story for Hysen's uh, Muhammad bin Rashid and Maktoum. Because you know this project already done uh, on 2018 by uh, another production company, but rejected from Hysen's uh, of uh, Sheikh Muhammad. Uh, and then the other production company uh, started again on uh, December 2019. And uh, I'm so lucky to join to this crew and they shortlist me to uh, embody the character of Hysen Sheikh Rashid bin Said Al Maktoum. So it's an amazing experience to be a part of the uh, history of uh, UAE. You'll be stay forever in uh, UAE yeah, history. Yeah, yeah. That's why I consider myself uh, very lucky and I pray for this project to be selected. Of course. And yes. to be approval from Hysen Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid. Mm -hmm. Then uh, you must be lucky, huh? I hope always lucky. What about uh, what was the funniest experience you had in a movie or commercial? <laughs> Can you share that? Yeah, it was with uh, with Brad Pitt personality. Brad Pitt. Yeah. Okay. What about Brad Pitt? When we make a shoot in War Machine, mm -hmm. you know, I told you uh, in Hollywood the crew uh, they are very organized. Uh, and they have a policy in location. The first policy is, is not allowed for you to hold your mobile with you in the location. Yeah, yeah. They take a mobile and keep it with them. So in this time, uh, I suddenly, I know that I was. Okay. Because we are more than 1,500 uh, 1, extra and it was uh, airport skin. So I'm not expecting that I will be close to Bradley. By the way, but I prepare that I will take a photo with Brabbe, especially he's my favorite actor. So in this day, I went to the location. I have two mobiles. Okay. I give it the first mobile for the security. Okay. okay, and I keep the other one in my packet. my packet. I should normally I stay uh, during the day. No one knows that I have a mobile on circuit. Okay. And then I'm waiting, waiting, waiting until finish the shoot. And in the end of the skins of bread, 
he is very respectable. He is uh, staying and he greet all of us. Thank you guys, thank you. I appreciate your attendance, I love you all. Thank you so much, thank you. I w I'm waiting until finish and um, go to him. I'm being very close. Okay. Once I'm starting to tell him, Brad, I want to take a photo, I'm... <gasps> What happened? Suddenly, I find his security guard. You know, I'm very tall. I'm yeah. 184, but I find the Superman. I'm looking for him like this. Please, I want to take a picture with Brad. I want to. He told me, <laughs> not allowed. I'm starting to acting and cry and make a drama for him to give me allowed to take a picture with Brad Pitt. Um, please, please, my mother wants to see my picture and my friend, he told me not to allow it. That was funny, huh? Um, shut down and run away. <laughs> <laughs> so this, it was very, very funny. But in the end, I'm, ha I'm sad because i am not got my target and I'm not taking a picture with Bambi. Uh, maybe next it. time, maybe in the future, maybe I will be famous actor also and you will meet again in another shoot or another project of course eventually. and i'm sure i will take a photo of him it's uh, that's good yes that was funny experience you have right and if you were to star in a movie what genre would that be and why actually i'd like to do all the rules the drama action comedy romantic but, but the most preferred to my heart comedy I'd like to be a comedian because you know I'm funny and I like to laughing and to make other people happy. Ah. So I think I will be very very well in comedy. Yes, sir. Yes. But I can do all. Mm -hmm. Drama. <laughs> <laughs> I I can let all people cry and the action can be yeah? dangerous. Yeah, I have experience in uh, Bollywood movie, but not complete this project. Okay. It was the Dollars movie. Mm -hmm. It was shoot, uh, shooting in uh, Rex Hasselheimer in 2014. My role is a big boss. Okay. I wear sunglasses and gold ring and I keep my shotgun in my hand and I'm so dangerous. Mm -hmm. I'm not talk to people, I only kill people. But it's not completed because uh, there's some problem for the production company, I think. Hopefully, it will be finished soon. I no, mean. it's already dead. Ah, already dead, okay. <laughs> 2014, and we are now 2020. So, it's six, uh, six years plus ago, so I think the, the production not completed. They changed their mind. Mm -hmm. I don't know why, but it's okay. But I'm telling you, I'm already do the action and the dangerous role. So I can do any role, funny, drama, crazy, uh, action, romantic, clever. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because you're romantic also. Yeah, in my in in real, I'm I'm honest and romantic. I'm so romantic. Okay. <laughs> okay. Any advice, Fadel, for the aspiring actors and models? Yeah, I advise anyone who have a goal or have a dream, uh, don't give up. Try and try and try as you uh, have a goal or as a, you have a dream. Firstly, you should trust in God and trust in your talent. Believe in your talent. Uh, believe in your dreams. Don't let your dreams uh, stop. Don't uh, don't have uh, impossible in your dictionary. Close your ears. Don't listen to any negative uh, people or negative uh, words. Don't let anyone stop you. Don't let anyone uh, make you down. Just be positive all time. Be confident and focus on your dream and your goal. And go, 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 go. You'll get what you want. I agree with you. That's good. When we return, let's have the Filipino food eating challenge.
Welcome back guys. Let's have the Filipino food eating challenge. So Fadel, we prepared something for you. This is isaw. This is Kabayan food? Yeah, it's Filipino oh, food. Amazing. Yeah. Would you like to try now? Yeah, I should. I have to try, but I want to ask you, is this is beef or chicken or seafood or what? <laughs> it's um intestine or chicken. Oh, okay. Is that fine with you? Yeah. Any Kabayan thing fine with me. Okay, go. This is a challenge for you. <laughs> it's very small. Yo, okay. Is there any beer or wine? <laughs> later, later. Alright. How is the taste? Are you sure this chicken? Yeah, yeah, it's chicken. It's like nuts. Nuts, okay. Actually, I'm not eating uh, isao. I don't like it. You don't like? Yeah. You like it or not? It's okay. It's like uh, peanut. <laughs> okay, guys. But I know Kabayan, there's more than uh, best Kabayan food, more than. This. What is this your full name? Isao. We call it Isao? Yeah. This is uh, Pisao, not Isao. Thank you again. Okay. Welcome back guys. Let's have a straight talk. Padel, are you okay? Or are you ready now? Yeah, I'm ready. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> Number one, chicken or beef? Beef. Red or black? I like it. Nice or naughty? Nice. <laughs> sexy or chubby? Sexy. It's very difficult, but I would choose sexy. Okay. Long hair or short, short long hair? Long hair. Long hair. Winter or summer? Uh, went to. Lights on or lights off? It's okay, the lights on. Okay. Sisha or Chivas? Chivas. Okay. <laughs> Pepsi or Coke? Pepsi. Nike or Adidas? Uh, Nike. McDonald's or KFC? Uh, KFC. Last one. Sex or chocolate? It's very difficult to answer this one. <laughs> It's very difficult. I, I can take both. I know, I know. Okay, no problem. Both, it's yeah. okay? Yeah. I like both. Okay. <laughs> Guys, this is the acting challenge that we've been waiting for because he's a good actor. Let's see how he acts in a drama series. Even if I don't, do, uh, I don't talk Tagalog, but I will do my best to be Kabayan. <laughs> okay. Are you excited, guys? Yes. yes. Okay, let's do this. Hindi pagkatayo in iwan nan maganda o mahal nante e kasi kasi baka miro dante namas okay namas okay. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Fadel, for the accepting the challenge for eating Filipino food for the movie acting challenge. Tagalog. Yeah, you always on the go. You're always uh, up for the challenge. I know, Fadel, you like you like kabayan, okay? So <laughs> it's a fact. It's a fact. Yeah. Um, what do you advise, or what did you want to say to all our kabayan? Firstly, uh, I'm talking from my heart. Uh, seriously, not uh, not joking. I like uh, Philippines, and uh, before I love Philippines, I respect uh, Filipino people. Uh, they are simple people, uh, funny, loving, uh, very respectable. Uh, I like uh, Filipina attitude. They treat with all people in all situation, in all time, with all respect. They always call you sir, madam, and always they are smiling. Mm -hmm. They are laughing. It's amazing attitude for for the human. Uh, whatever they have a pain or they have a problem, because you know all people have a problem and have a pain in their life, but Kabayan. Always smiling, always, always laughing, always respect. That's why I respect and love 
all Kapayan people. I love Philippines too much and I planning, I'm planning to visit Philippines but I will not stay too much in uh, Manila. I supposed to go to Provence and explore uh, amazing and new city in Philippines. Love you Kapayan. I love you. Mahal ka Mahal kayo. Mahal kayo. Lahal. Lahal. Yay! I told you, you I, I like Philippines and I like Kabayan. <laughs> and I make a special promotion for all Kabayan. Go ahead, anyone, please. Anyone like our video, just leave your name in comment and I promise I will apply to you and contact you. This is special promotion only for Kabayan. <laughs> subscribe, guys, subscribe. Yeah. Guys, subscribe to uh, our channel, Gerald Rosario. <laughs> you are awesome. And follow our uh, our interview. I'm waiting you and I'm waiting your name and I promise I will reply to you. Okay, thank you, Madam. Thank you. Thank you guys for watching. See you on next awesome episode.